Welcome back to the final episode of Donkey Kong Country 3. And we still have to get 100%. Unfortunately. Oh yeah, and I guess we have to figure out what these birds are for since we've just kind of been collecting them for no real reason. You know. And there we are, our glorious 99%, but we could do better than that. So let's take Wrinkly's advice and go visit Funky Kong. We'll see if he's got anything new for us. Oh yeah, we did that. That was pretty awesome. Oh. How mean. Oh. Okay, then. So yeah, we get the gyrocopter, which is the best vehicle in the game. Because you can just fly anywhere with it. So we're gonna go check out... Oh, here, there's Pacifica. So we're gonna go check out this corner of the map, and there's this place. Um, you know it's just a wall, right? Like, you can go around it. Or through the cloud, or... Oh. It's magic, of course. That makes more sense. Ah. So, yeah. This is the reason you have to collect all the banana birds. In order to open this door and get the final, final ending. So anyway, before we do that, we're going to go visit our friend, Bazaar, one last time. Because he actually has something to tell us about the caves. Hmm, good thing I have exactly 13 coins and didn't actually have to grind off screen for them. Lucky me. Well, we already have the gyrocopter, so that's good. Oh, you tricky bastard. Well, we paid 13, so between that and the two banana birds that we got from bears, there are actually 15 banana birds in the game. However, you can only get three of them with the gyrocopter, and there's one of them now. I don't have much to say about these, other than they do get harder by this point now that you need to memorize like 8 button presses. So it might take a few tries if you're not good at that kind of thing. The next one is actually over in the top right corner of the map, on top of this cliff above Razor Ridge. Oh shit, I actually screwed up once. Oh well, it doesn't matter. Because you get like infinite tries. And finally, the last one is just on the island in the lake. The last one is the hardest one because you have to remember like nine button presses. With that out of the way, we've gotten all the banana birds. So I guess let's go free the banana bird queen. Oh yeah, well I guess she has all the birds right now, so... Alright, fine. So 
So all the way back to Wrinkly's place. Good thing there's one on the overworld. Alright, time to soar. Just look like a swarm of bees, but that's because of... I don't know. It just seems kind of weird. Freedom. Wait, why are you guys walking away? There's still things to do. Oh no! K. Rule stole our hovercraft and got really drunk. What the fuck is he doing? Wow, he's doing a good job of trying to swerve around her, but... And that's the end of that. Oh, hey, dudes. Wow, that, that Cranky's pretty good at, uh, at water skiing. I forget what the term is, but whatever. Okay, now you're just showing off. Funky, no, what are you doing? R.I.P. Funky. Yep. That's the end of everything. Kind of weird, but okay. And we have 103%, which is the highest you can get in a normal game. So now it's time to show off some cheat codes. Entering music gives us a music test, of course. We got all these uh, songs from every point in the game. We'll play some Rocket Run, because that only shows up in the very last stage, and I think it's a good song, despite only showing up there. And of course we got the Christmas theme, too, which doesn't get used at all unless you use the Mary cheat code. I like it. Anyway, time to show off other cheats. A save will make it so that every stage automatically saves after you beat it. Lives gives you 50 lives. Water is kind of weird because if you start the game and then go under this waterfall over here, you play another one of these banana bird games. But when you complete it, you actually get all 85 bonus coins immediately. The last sheet I wanted to show off is if you put this on a new game, it only works on a new game for some reason, but if you put it in toughest, then when you go through a level, all of the DK barrels and all of the checkpoint barrels are removed from the stage. 
And this happens in every single stage, I believe, so it becomes really difficult to get by. But if you can beat the entire game on toughest mode, you get 105% at the very end. Since this is just a demonstration of uh, the toughest code, I'm going to wrap it up here. I'd like to thank all my guests for joining me. I'd like to thank everybody who posted in the thread for for uh, sharing your words. I'd like to thank Matroyster for helping me fix the GBA version to work, and I'd like to thank Suspicious Dish for the sprite edits. Thank you very much, and goodbye. Also, one last thing. You can press any of the face buttons here to mess with the blocks. And you can also mash them and it'll go all the way up to the ceiling. That's just silly.